Mr. Joseph E. Clements. Mr. Clements is a restaurateur from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Mr. Clements is also a certified public accountant by training, and his company, Clements Management, currently operates nine Burger King restaurants in central Louisiana. Mr. Clements is here to testify on behalf of the National Restaurant Association, founded in 1919. The association is the leading business association for the restaurant industry. Welcome, sir. Thank you, Madam Chairwoman, Mr. Shabbat. I'd like to thank the members of the committee for the invitation to offer testimony today on behalf of the National Restaurant Association about ways in which to update the tax code and help stimulate the economy. As, as, as stated, I've been in the restaurant business for 13 years, and I currently own and operate nine Burger King franchise restaurants in Louisiana, and I employ approximately 300 people. Prior to my entry into the restaurant business, I practiced public accounting for almost 19 years, where my firm provided services to small businesses uh, just like the one I own today. <clears throat> I'm here today to discuss the need for reforms in the depreciation schedules, specifically to shorten the lives of the write-off the write of the restaurant buildings and improvements to 15-year lives. This would create an immediate economic activity within the industry, which in turn would reverberate throughout the economy. There's currently legislation pending in the 110th Congress which addresses accelerated depreciation. H.R. Uh, 3622, championed by Congressman Kendrick Meek of Florida and Patrick Tiberi of Ohio, uh, would make permanent a 15-year depreciable life uh, for newly constructed restaurants as well as for, new, uh, for improvements on restaurants. The bill currently enjoys bipartisan support with over 160 co-sponsors, including 18 members of this committee. There's no question that restaurant depreciation schedules are outdated. According to the tax code, restaurant buildings have a useful life of 39 and a half years over which they can be written off. To suggest that a restaurant building's useful life is 39 and a half years is just ludicrous. The wear and tear on restaurant buildings is probably greater on, that, on this type of building than on